This is Judge Joe Brown, and we're listening to We All Be News. News Free Dixie for the 21st century. We are being on the hill on Brother Marino and his art show, The Man from Mars. How you doing today, sir? I'm doing pretty good. I'm pretty good. That's good, man. So tell us about this show. Like, why are you entitled The Man from Mars? Uh, really, Mars is like my alter ego. Uh, uh -huh. It's another style that I use. So Mars is like, uh, everybody got two sides. Mm -hmm. Mars is like my alter ego. Uh, and that's what that means. The, the, the owner of the venue kind of came up with the name because I didn't have a name for the show. Yeah. She came up with the man from Mars. So I know it's deep. You probably expect some deeper than that. But Mars is um, a nickname that was given to me in elementary uh, because I was always like in a zone, you know, zoned out. You know, so, you know it was basically like a chick. You know how you check, check back in the elementary. So. That's where the name came from. But they always said I act like I was from Mars. And that's just, it became me, you know what I'm saying? The man from Mars. I became Mars. That's who I am. Mars. Well, it's good to be different sometimes. Definitely your art style really stands out for being something different. Yeah. What's the inspiration behind your, your style of art? Um, the inspiration was. Um, like, just every artist that I see just inspires me. Just every artist. Um, the inspiration to, um, to have my own, have my own style that you can see, and it's on, um, you can know it's my style. That inspires me to make it, to be original. It just, originality inspires me. I, I really can't say it. Well, I see a certain like rhythm to your to the way you do your art and create your art. Mm -hmm. You do have a musician background, correct? Yeah. Okay. Sure. You talk a little bit about that. Yeah. Um. I'm I'm from a circle of beat makers. Uh, my uncle, he a musician. I was I was raised around my uncle a lot, and uh, he played for um, a Memphis group on um, the Fingerprints, Kevin Page, uh, back in the days. Uh, and he trained a lot of my friends, you know, to make beats. Mm -hmm. So actually, it's, it's funny you said that a lot of my, own, I'm thinking about making beats when I work on my artwork. That's what I'm thinking about. I, I, I be in the zone like a beat maker, you know what I mean? I, it's like I'm making making a song or a beat or writing music. Mm -hmm. So, cause that's something that I wish I had done. Uh, and everybody say you you can still make beats, but um, I prefer to just put that energy behind my artwork instead of. Do you have like certain themes or subject matter like uh, exploring your artwork? Anything like any subjects in particular? Um, ideas. Um, the the woman shape the shape of a woman. Um, you no know, sex. Yes. Um, <laughs> Most of these, and uh, really what I'm doing, I really want to say, a lot of my pieces uh, come from my initials. So I'm doing my initials MJW over again. That's why they look like um, butterflies or, mm -hmm. or swirls and stuff. Yeah. 